treats and some Tim Hortons coffee. What more could you ask for? So how much do you know about the D? Those bits of wisdom could win you a prize from Tim Hortons. We'll have more on that in a moment. But first, if you love Tim Hortons coffee and your cup of java today can make a big difference in the lives of thousands of kids and give them a memory they will treasure forever. Here to tell us about this is um, from our friends at Tim Hortons, our Mark Johnson with the Tim Hortons Children Foundation and Maureen Finnegan, a Tim Hortons restaurant owner. And also here is Aubrey, a camper. Thank you all for being here. Thank Our pleasure. Goodness. We appreciate you. So today is a special day at Tim Hortons. How can buying a cup of coffee at Tim Hortons today help kids across the country? So yeah, I'll take that one because today is camp day, which means 100% of hot coffee and iced coffee proceeds at any Tim Hortons restaurant gets donated directly to the Tim Hortons camps for campers like Aubrey here. This is awesome. So what are the camps like? Well, it's very fun, of course. You get to do all these different activities and you get to earn a bunch of skills that you can use later on in life. That's awesome, that's awesome. So who does the camp help? Helps our kids, helps local kids, which is great. So uh, we as owners are invested in our communities and our kids. Yeah, and any camp is such a great experience. And I, I went to winter camp as a kid. Mm -hmm. um, how do you feel like the, Im the, the experience is gonna impact their lives going forward? Yeah, so as Aubrey mentioned, the kids are gonna learn skills about goal setting, perseverance, overcoming adversity. And these are lifelong skills that will help them get to post-secondary education, college, university, mm -hmm. things of that nature. Mm -hmm. And I think you also learn soft skills learning how to get along with people, learning how to follow orders, right? This is all part of that growing up process. Mm -hmm. Right, helping each other, peaceful yes. conflict resolution, building yes. positive relationships. These are necessary skills yep. for sure. Making friends, absolutely. So let's talk about the bracelets that are right by you, Maureen. Can you hold that up for me? Sure. So I'm actually wearing one. These are Tim Hortons camp bracelets and you can purchase these at a restaurant locally near you. All right, and how do these help support Tim Hortons camps? Do the proceeds from that go towards? Yes. Okay. Directly to the campers as well. All right, so how else can anyone help support the camp? So go to the website, that's uh, timhortons.com <laughs> uh, slash US camps, and you can donate uh, singly or monthly, uh, whatever you like. Okay. Mm -hmm. Which I'll one? get more decaf. How about okay. that? I'll go get yeah, a decaf, sure. decaf <laughs> today for Thank sure. Thank you. Can you send me that one right there? The chocolate one? Yeah, chocolate I had my chocolate. eye on that that's one. You. Oh, yeah. you, that's you? <laughs> Aubrey, what was your favorite part of camp? Well, I love the camp as like in entirety, but I'd say my favorite part was um, the feeling of earning my beads. Mm. And the beads that there's um, specific beads that you earn when you like accomplish a task. When you uh, when you accomplish different things, like you can get beads for goal setting and reflection and peace and all those all that good stuff. That's awesome, and I hear you're going again. Yeah, I am. Um, are you excited? I, yeah, I am very excited. Okay. And this time I'm going to a camp in Northern Ontario. Ooh. And we're, we're gonna be going on canoe trips and doing all sorts of water stuff and it's gonna be great. Okay, this sounds great, I wanna go. So we have to definitely support this camp. <laughs> to find out more about Tim Hortons Camp Day and how you can support it, visit their website, timhortons.com slash US Camp Day. And every day we'll be giving away a $25 gift card to Tim Hortons if you can share your bits of wisdom about the D. So here's your question for the week. Are you guys ready? What was the first major department store in the country to have air conditioning? If you know the answer, go to our Live in the D Facebook page or the contest page at click on Detroit.com. Contest rules are posted there as well. Your correct answer qualifies you for your chance to win.